It is the big one. The Powerball jackpot has hit historic heights. $1.6 billion up for grabs tomorrow night. I think we're all at this point sort of feeling that lottery fever. Yeah, it's been coming on now for, for weeks, a while. too. <laughs> While the odds of winning are long, the state is making money on every ticket we buy. And WBC's Brandon Truett shows us where that money goes. It's a jackpot so big, the signs displaying the winnings aren't even built for it. $1.6 billion up for grabs. It's never been higher. There's a Powerball fever going on right now. The Massachusetts State Lottery brings in billions a year. There are rules for where it goes. Massachusetts joins Maine, Connecticut, and Rhode Island in putting money toward the general fund. These states pass out money to cities and towns who determine how they want to spend it. But Vermont and New Hampshire opted for an education lottery, all funds going to school improvements. Here at home, nearly three quarters of the state lottery money goes to private. Prizes. About 20% goes to cities and towns. In the 50 years it's been operating, the Massachusetts State Lottery has returned over $31 billion to municipalities, including more than $1 billion this year alone. You know, it's been our mission since 1972 when we first sold our first lottery ticket that all of our profits from the lottery goes directly to cities and towns. Boston leads the pack, getting more than $200 million this year. On the other side of the spectrum, the town of Gosnold, the island between Buzzards Bay and the Vineyard, gets 2300 bucks. The amount each town receives is based on a formula created by the state legislature. We rely heavily on state aid in the town of Draco. Ann Vandal is the town manager in Drake. It. She says about a quarter of the town's annual budget counts on state aid, a good portion of which comes from the lottery. The money is spent on everything from snow plows, public safety, and education. Because it gives us the ability to focus in areas and, and move money around when we need to. None of this includes the taxes. Massachusetts would take off the winnings if the lucky ticket is sold here. It is big money in winnings and paying it forward. All you need is the six numbers to match to feel it firsthand. The folks at the lottery are reminding people this is supposed to be fun. Play responsibly and within your means. The next drawing is on Saturday night, but tickets have to be purchased by 9.50 that evening for them to qualify. Good luck, and I hope you'll think of me if you win. In Boston, Brandon True at WBZ News. <laughs> we'll definitely give Brandon Absolutely. some money, right? Absolutely, right. That presumes that we're no going to win something at yeah, some that's point. That's right. We're not going to tell you how much, Brandon, but we'll give you something. <laughs> we'll give you a little something. something. <laughs>